Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play series for Oxygen Not Included. A um, couple things. Uh, learning that this works. That's great news. Really, really happy with that. Um, considering ways to cool down all of this metal ore up here that's, wow, 300 degrees, 80 degrees. It's a lot. That's a lot. Um, yeah, just gotta create a cooling loop, I guess. I mean, we could just dump the temperature over here. It would very, very quickly melt this, and we'd probably need to counterbalance, do a thing over here, with like a hot box. <laughs> hot box. And uh, then if we did it well enough, we could even dump it down over here and possibly get that, although that would be more for fun to see if we could, because I don't think we need iron. We're getting so much iron. Just, but with this alone, never mind the iron we actually have, the 47 tons of it. We got 9.6 tons of plastic. That's, that's not bad. Uh, also, 4,000. It's almost 4 tons of... 5 tons of uh, steel. So it's really good. Um, okay, uh, what are we doing? What are we going to do this episode, eh? This is getting closer. Uh, the pip was delivered in there. He should be planting seeds. And that's going to turn that into a nice, beautiful nature reserve. Uh, going to actually deconstruct this. That can go too. Uh, that way they can come from over this side. And anywhere coming from here is going to have to run through the suits to get over into all the nasty, dangerous stuff. Just get rid of that, just for safeties. Um, yeah, so that should work. It is a little bit longer trip, but I think that it will make up for it. You're gonna trap her over there, aren't you? Oh, okay, good. I will start doing some deconstruction on this. Always permitted. Hmm. What's this one? Always permitted. Why does this one have the do not enter, and this one has like a duplicates this way sign? Yeah. Vacancy only. Wait, now it's at always... I, I don't know. It's like saying it's a different thing than it is, I, and I don't... It's confusing me. So I'm just going to ignore it until it becomes a problem. Because that is the solution to all of life's difficult things. So just ignore it until it becomes a problem. Okay, they can't get over here and do any crazy crap, so I am thinking I'm just going to, like, slap a wall here and uh, call that a day, because they can deliver suits from here if they get a suit in there and put it in and whatnot. Uh, how is this? Is this functioning? This is functioning. Uh, this water is going to have germs. I can't probably tell because I would need to look at the water itself, but I know there's germs in this water. It's poop water. So now we're actually going to get a net positive water out of that, which, like, my god, do I need, like, some reed fibers to dump in this polluted water? just eliminate it, because I, I don't like the germy polluted water. Um, I just, I've tried to make chlorine boxes and stuff for it before, and it just never really worked out for me, so... Yeah, okay. That, yeah, that's all good. Perhaps it would not be a terrible plan to possibly go, oh, I don't know, over here? 
Something like this? Just like straight across? Yeah. Let's do that. Let's go exploring. Uh, we are going to need a couple different things. This igneous rock is pretty much everywhere. That will get us across there. Uh, is any sand going to fall? I don't know. Get across there. It can get almost all the way over here. Maybe just a little dupe there. Yeah, uh -huh, uh -huh. And that should reveal basically the whole map up at that top part. Well, at least into space. And that's kind of what I want to see. Uh, also, I'm going to start dropping a ladder down into all of this bed ass over here. I'm just going to keep that level with this other wall that I started deconstructing. I did something like so. I don't really need it here, but I'm gonna put it there because I like it looking even. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the Abyssalite is like better, if not equivalent, to what was this? Specific heat capacity four, thermal conductivity of zero. That's Abyssalite. And this is Specific heat capacity of one thermal conductivity. Yeah, so <laughs> the the, uh, the abyssalite is way way better for storing and preventing the transfer of heat than the actual insulated tile. So this is actually not in our best interest, but I want to do it because I like things to be even. So <laughs> I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Go ahead, run some of these like this. Do something like that. And we will just do something like that. That will be a-okay. Uh, actually. Actually. Is there any reason for me to cap this off? I don't really think so. I don't think the temperature... I don't care about the temperature leaking too much. Okay, it's fine. I was like, that sounded bad. You know what? I do. Because it would be inefficient, and that would be foolish. So we're just going to go ahead and do this. Now, this is probably actually worse than the open ladder as well, because the metal door transfers the heat extremely efficiently. Um, I've seen people actually use, uh, not the manual airlocks, but the mechanized airlocks. Because you can manually control them to, like, facilitate heat transfer between hot stuff and not hot stuff. Uh, it acts as, like, your temperature break, because when it opens, it'll create a vacuum, which the temperature cannot travel through. The more you know. Okay, so if all this comes together... We start thinking about that as being a cold thing that we can pump liquid through. Uh, we will need over here a, a power generation uh, area where we are going to do a thermal tuner. We got dreglets. We got uh, people that are kind of spread all over the place, and I don't want any of them. Bye. What was I doing? Oh, yes. Hotbox. Uh, so for this over here, we can kind of do somewhat like... The, uh, utility aqua tuner out of steel. Ooh, 1,200. I don't quite have enough yet. But we're almost there. I thought I had a whole buttload of steel. Oh, it's all gone. Somewhere? What did I build out of steel? Lead? Lead? Let's 
I say, like, I know there was some steel sitting here. I didn't accidentally build, like, something random out. I probably built some random thing out of steel by accident. Oh, also, having a more efficient metal refinery probably be alright. Because uh, this has got to be getting a little bit spicy. Yeah, look at that. 36, 28. It's getting a little warm down here. How's this doing for temperature, actually? That's not temperature. Temperature. Uh, 19, coming in at 9. Wait, yeah, coming in at 9. Right, it's leaving hotter. Because it's coming in... Uh, cooled down, actually, from right here. <laughs> and it's heating up down here. Ah, fun stuff. If I could think of a way... I mean, I guess I could scrub carbon dioxide out of the air with the uh, loop thing I was doing. That would just cost power. And that would give us some negative 55 degree carbon dioxide stuff, which would be uh, super handy. Is this running? Excellent. We have oxygen still. Someone's dying. You absolute fool. Why have you done this? If you do this one, it will save your life. But, you know, you just do you or whatever. Like, I just don't understand how he's down here dying. And it's like, do this. This is the thing that you need to do. And he's like, nah. Nah, brah. Like, I don't know. Hey, man. What are you, is there anyone nearby? Toby? No, you're not nearby. Mima is doing it. Uh, Mima is doing it. Like I just, it bothers me. I can't, I can't believe it sometimes. How insanely dumb the dupes can be. Okay, dude, please come here. Dig this. You will live. Literally, that's all you need to do. And you can escape. And Mima is still coming for it. She's like, I'm a coming. You know what? Uh, you resigned to your fate, Abe. Uh, if Mima can't save you, no one can. Look, you're free. Can you make it? Don't you do it, Mima. What are you doing? Are you digging that? You're gonna, you dug it. Oh, man. Ugh. It's so painful to watch. Like, why are you intentionally offing yourself? Man? No, escape. You can't anymore because there's not enough room, is there? Yeah, you can't get up there. Oh, my God. Zeus and Abe are coming to do this. Abe, I would recommend that you put this on your priority list and, like, get it done. Oh, yeah, you've dug yourself deeper. Okay. I will get another grave ready. You clearly did not meet the intelligent quotient required for surviving in the meteorite, asteroid, whatever you want to call it. Where's a good spot for Abe? Like, right here? That's a good spot. Ah, oh, let me guess. Mm, yes. I did no way saw that coming. Stupid dupe. It'd be cool to uh, get that natural gas geyser pumping down to where I want it as well. Steel, 1060. Can we make some more? Yeah, we're just doing that forever. Let's turn that off. We don't need that, but I do want this. Unreachable, because there's no suits in the suit thing. You guys can totally get over here, right? Because it would be silly if you could not. It's just no suits there, that's the problem, right? There's a bunch of dupes running around my base in suits, aren't there? 
Or where did they abandon them? I don't see any suits laying on the ground. Right, let's prioritize this to like a seven. Let's get that done. Oh, there's like four. Five, six. I think we had six before, so that adds up. We'd need another three. Uh, so, copper, eh? I, I don't want to make them out of copper. That's, that's like what I got. I, I, I don't have iron. Oh, it's just raw iron. Not... Okay. We'll make them out of copper. That's fine. Uh, plant them seeds, Pip. Nature Reserve? That's the better one, right? What is the better one? Yeah, a park and then a nature reserve. Okay. We now have a nature reserve. Ah, uh, suits are being delivered. Fantastic news. Dope, dope, dope. I mean, this is kind of not the best spot to be setting up this. Uh, but I don't want to pipe something from, like, way down here up here to cool off any of that stuff. What am I... Oh, right, I'm cooling off my oxygen down here. So this is all good. I don't need one down here. I really don't need one down here. My goodness. That's another thing I should do. Uh, let's kind of recombobulate this a touch, shall we? Gas tanks over here. Yeah, that's a good spot. Oh, hydrogen vent. Let's enable that. So our hydrogen doesn't back up. Um, what would this do if I were like, oh, I don't know, one, two, I can do three, I have to get rid of this, I will. I think I can safely get rid of that as well. do here, what the plan is, is we're going to take this tank, and we're going to copy it, get it, get it uh, over here as well. Uh, we're going to run some piping, and we're going to take this, and this would normally, we might actually switch this over this way, uh, and like gas filter right here, which would do something like this, and into there. Uh, our filtered output would be our hydrogen, which would go into our input. And we are just going to a uh, flippy floppy like so. No, I don't like that. Already don't like it. We're going to uh, come out like this. Out like this, in there, out like this, in there, and then this will be our new output. We're actually just gonna, yeah, zigzag that down. Two. Yeah, yeah, right? No, we need it a little bit more down. Down there is what we need it. 
that's gonna plug in there. That should work okay, I think. Here, if we get rid of this. And a little bit of this as well. are barely maintaining the consumption on that, but I'd like a bigger buffer. Negative 2, 24. That's a 10. Oh, just being on the edge of it is kind of enough to... Oh, this is set to zero now. Like, we didn't do that. Uh, let's go to 15. This was at 10. Faster! Deconstruct this for me, so I can continue. Thank you. What I was doing. Uh, the the filter, please. Build. Uh, the input. Is the output. Uh, input. As uh, the output. Uh, this will. Nope. Not all of that. Just uh, this part here can go. This will come over here, that will go there, this will go here, we will put a high pressure vent on that. Yeah, we're going to put a high pressure vent there, that's fine. Uh, lead and plastic, that is just perfect for our purposes. Um, very conveniently still generating power and putting hydrogen into that line while we get this set up, so unintended effects, nice. I'll give them a second on that. They're going to take a second. What else can we look at? Yeah, we're, we're doing real good on, like, waters and stuff. Um, a ton of natural gas down here. Perhaps. I could run... Oh, there's that right there. I was going to say, I'll put tanks here like I did for the other goodies. Where would I put a bunch of tanks for these? I, I want to put them right here. I could do this way. What is this doing here? Why is there a water seed? Right, for all the polluted water coming out of the natural gas generators. But duh. I could go up top, actually. It would not be terrible. Uh, it would require... Minimal rejiggering. Uh, presuming that we use like a cold box over here and continued running this this way, it would need to come down and back up and then could go into storage, which would be okay. So I'm thinking right here is going to be the best spot for that. So we'll get a little head start on that. I suppose, yeah, I can just get rid of these ladders. These don't need to be here. That'll let us fit a third tank in there. How are we doing down here? How are we doing up here? Is, uh, everything still just buried? Nice. Look at all the, uh, buried objects, eh? Oh, wow, that's overheated and dead. That's bad. I hope they haven't been just repairing that. Maybe that's where all the steel went. Have they just been repairing this over and over? 200. I really need to get a cooling loop in here, don't I? All right. Uh, the more you know. All right. I'll live and learn. You know. And then get loves. 
Uh, unfortunately, none of this is working now that uh, all of this is... Oh, man. Okay. That means this isn't going to close. Ignoring problems until they go away. That's, that's what we do here. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. So, yeah, I got to get this set up before I can really do much up here. Because I, I got to keep these doors closed or I'm going to have to keep repairing all of this stuff. Huh. Okay. Yeah, I, I guess that's the ticket. We'll have to, have to get that running. In the meanwhile... How are we doing? We've got almost this all built. Uh, oh, that's gonna need some power, eh? How did... I think it's all... Heavy watt down here. Yeah, it is. Just kinda spoop that off there. Uh, dig that stuff out. That can go. We're starting to back up that line pretty bad. Just like all of this would be great. Also, this needs to be done. There's no reason I can't hook this in over here. This will end up being just extra. It's got power. Uh, select hydrogen. Oh, there's also an automation line running right here that we can get rid of a piece of. I, I'm assuming I need to mop that. Oh, that is set to, uh... Oh, they gotta run the aluminum from all the way up top, don't they? And they gotta build the floor. Or it won't work. Pretty sure on that one. Please? Rowan the man. Rowan the man! Being a hero. That should let the spice flow. Getting rid of our backup problems. Yeah. All right. All right. Now we can eliminate this stuff. We also need to get rid of some of this stuff here. Because we're going to two, three, do at least two more of these. Yeah, two more. Oh, you're trapped there, aren't you? You fool. Have a great time. It's a shortfall. Okay, yeah, then we're gonna have to do one of you here. There's no way I could get away with that would be one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, 
three. If I actually moved this over one more tile, I could fit another two generators. But I don't want to do that. I'm actually, I'm real tempted to start anew. Um, it always happens that way. You get the base and you're like, oh yeah, I want to start again. I mean, I guess that's why I never make it to space, right? Oh, well, that'll need power. Yeah, power's good. Uh, just straight across. Bam! Right into the line. Just like so. Oh, that can go. That's all set for deconstruct. That is pumping. Spice is flowing. Things are doing the things they need to be doing. And we're just gonna do a zig. Ooh, 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 you know what would be cool? Is if we had a way... Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna zigzag. <laughs> In fact, you know what? It means I don't even need to get rid of this. I do need to get rid of this, though. Because I'm just gonna take this, and I'm gonna zig, and I'm gonna zag. And I'm gonna do some decon on that. It'll come out here, there, over here, and in there. And oh, we also will need the uh, yeah, the automation wire plugged in. What is the quickest way to run this? Probably like this. That'll take the least amount of line. All right, so now we have four, a bunch of backup uh, tank space. Uh, so that is a little bit more of a stable setup. Is this in any danger of freezing? 28? No, okay. We've heated this up enough. We're not too scared about that. Uh, is it worth doing insulated tile here? Like, honestly, I think kind of the uh, temperature being out and about is not a bad thing. Because we got some hot stuff going on. Our base is... Uh, our base actually isn't that bad. It's actually a fairly cool looking map. Oh my goodness, this is a cool map. I was playing on what the heck was it, uh, like the volcano, Vol Volcania, on my uh, days off, and whew, that was hot. I accidentally burrowed into like a 1,200 degree rock without looking at the temperature screen. It was, it was an experience. Let me tell you that. Um, unfortunately, that is where we are going to end today's episode. Uh, we made some progress. We've improved our oxygen setup down here a touch. Oh, before we go, let's stop off and pick up some shine nymph eggs, because we need those. Yeah, we've got our nature reserve set up. Our dupes are running through there, getting suits, so that, that's great news. Um, pretty sure they made some suits, so those can be delivered there. Uh, yeah. Oh, we got a snazzy suit up here, too. Tell you, I could just get lost in this game. As I was saying, that's the end of this episode, you guys. If you guys like what you're seeing, please do. Uh, feel free to leave a like. Feel free to subscribe. It's going to encourage me to make more content like this for you. If you have suggestions for games, uh, things I'm doing in this game, things I'm doing in other games, anything, throw that down in the comments. I'm replying to that. I'm looking at that. I'm taking feedback. I'm... Um, Communing with the community, as it were. And I hope you guys will join me in the next episode. Bye now.